property is going up for auction this month. It's a luxury penthouse in the Ritz-Carlton residences on Singer Island. Terry Parker took a tour, didn't make a bid, checked out the amenities and tells us what you need to do if you would like to make a bid. Welcome to the signature residences at the Ritz-Carlton. This will take you into the master suite. From the master suite to the living area, this 6,000 square foot penthouse boasts a water view from each room and it's all going up for auction January 16th. There's two pools with jacuzzis, you have a restaurant which has dining room services and then you have the beach service as well. So it's just like living in a resort. It's phenomenal. Four bedrooms and five baths, including a master, his and hers. This is the her bathroom. Excuse me while I get ready for my close-up. The kitchen gleams with acres of white marble, a stovetop hood that goes up and down at the touch of a button, a built-in cappuccino maker, double oven and microwave, and a wine cooler with zones for red and white. Champagne, you don't need to chill because you know what I want. The entertainment room off the gray room looks onto the 2,500 square foot terrace. And if the vultures annoy you, there's a device to scare them away. And if you need to pay for all of this, there's an office. Okay, I'm ready to do some work. If you can stop staring at the ocean. This penthouse comes fully furnished and decorated. Check out these views. Opening bids will start at $5.9 million. So if you'd like to bid on this penthouse, the deadline is January 15th, 5 o'clock. And you've got to pony up Check half a million dollars in a refundable deposit. And then the auction takes place the next day right here. On Singer Island, Terry Parker, WPBS 25 News. It's very important to have the zones for the red and the white. You have You've to got have to have the zones. I thought it was expensive, but if it's fully furnished. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, I'm putting a bit in. <laughs> yeah, right on it would be nice month. to sit out on those balconies yeah. in this chilly weather. Not tomorrow. No. I don't know. It can be kind of fun to get all bundled up. <laughs> I, would not take it out. Yeah, I wouldn't last, would I? <laughs> I? No, I say it's going to be a shock to the system because we've been used to 70s.